started lifting weights when I was in high school, believe it or not, with the intention of becoming a bodybuilder. I think I saw it on TV and was like, wow, I want to do that. I always like to have a personal trainer just to keep me on track and to keep me um, accountable. And I had done CrossFit and bodybuilding and powerlifting and all these things, you know, a little bit of CrossFit. And that I loved when I was younger, but as I've gotten older, it's just too hard on my body. You know, it's like their philosophy is as heavy as you can, as fast as you can, and that's a recipe for an injury. <laughs> So I felt like I always had a little injury or something nagging for bodybuilding to get the size, I think, is more power lifting. And then to sort of shape the muscle is accessory work. I found starting strength and I found somebody to help me with my diet and keep me on track with that. And I love the coaching. It's so nice to have somebody make sure your form is right because it's never quite perfect. So there's always room for, you know, little tweaks. And even though, you know, I feel like I kind of know what I'm doing, you can't see yourself lifting. So you don't know what little mistakes you're making. I love that it's a smaller group and you get to know each other and you cheer each other on. And I love everything about it. I've always been what they call a hard gainer where I have a really hard time putting on mass. So I was doing accessory work five days a week. So the coaches here were nice enough to let me do my thing plus some accessory work here. And then the other days that I wasn't here, I was doing all accessory stuff and cardio and walking. And so I competed again just this past May and I did really well. I got first in my age class and then um, I got first overall masters. And then I came in second in the open, which is like every age all together. I've heard so many women say, I don't want to do powerlifting or even any weightlifting because I don't want to get bulky. And I just think that muscle is so beautiful on a woman. You just look strong, you look confident. People don't want to mess with you. <laughs> <laughs> so I personally think muscle is just beautiful and I've always liked it and I don't feel like I'm bulky and I'm actually bulkier now than I was because again I'm trying to build muscle. It was so hard for me to gain any muscle that it's hard for me to understand why women say I don't want to get bulky. I think that's funny because you're not gonna, it takes so much to gain muscle. I definitely feel like there's a complete misunderstanding when people, women, think that they're gonna walk into a gym and gain weight. That seems to be the big fear is gaining weight, gaining muscle to where your clothes don't fit. And I have put in so many hours to do just that, that it's not really a big concern. <laughs> You're lucky if you can put on that much muscle. My background is I'm a nurse and I was considering going back to nursing, but now I'm considering uh, maybe doing an internship here at Starting Strength because <laughs> I just love it so much. And it is, it's the confidence. It's just what I love to do. It's my hobby, it's my passion. I could spend all day either doing it or teaching somebody how to do it or talking about it or whatever. I just really enjoy it. I definitely have peers that I see, um, like other moms at the school, other friends that aren't as interested as I am in working out. And I feel bad for them because they don't seem to have the energy that I have and the youthful, I mean, I hate to say that because it's talking about myself, but um, I don't feel like I look 51. So I like that. <laughs>